Hi, ladies. Hi. I'm Debbie. She is. I'm Cindy. I am. Every day. Yes. We are here with Cindy's Wannable monthly subscription box. Well, it is a monthly box, at, but I was getting so tired of one of the Wannable and I send back everything. It's way too expensive. They weren't putting a box together. They were throwing random pieces in. And one of our subscribers said, oh my gosh, I get Wannable and Natalia is like the best. And I said, okay, well, I just got a Wannable box in. I will request Natalia. Well, this is Natalia's box and she did do a pretty good job. Um, it had it is one of the better wannable boxes for my sense of style so I, I am happy about that and i was getting it once a quarter but i changed it to every other month if i can keep natalia because although a few of these pieces didn't work out for me you'll see in a minute so the potential was far better than any wannable box that i've got in a long time okay so the first piece i'm going to show you now this had potential this is from I actually like Fobo. this on you i don't know why you didn't keep it it's kind of a fun shirt of course i don't know how you what would you pair that with oh jeans jeans i mean yeah, it's still... really a cute it's a knit top white jeans in the summer would look really cute and it had this and you're probably seeing it now, and it's got the crisscross back. It was really attractive on you. It was slimming, didn't pull in anywhere. Yeah, but you know, I guess when I turned around and then I kind of looked at the videos before I would make any kind of assumption, there was just something about the front of it. And I don't know, maybe it's the design. Maybe I know it looks like a zebra print or something, but it just looked so plain and just so... And you gotta like it when it's Older. fifty eight dollars. Is that how much it mm -hmm. is? I know Bobo, you can buy this like from Nordstroms and stuff. So the fit of the shirt was nice. I think I wish it would have been in a different print. I don't know, but the front of it, maybe if the back was the front with the crisscross, but it just looked too plain for me. I don't know. I I can't describe it. When I saw it, I'm like, yeah, no, it's a little. I don't even want to use the word matronly because it's not a matronly shirt. But now to me, this neck shirt is matronly. Yeah, I don't like this one um, at all. I don't like the color. I don't like the style. So this is by Skies Are Blue. And I Blue. generally like Skies Are Blue stuff. Yeah. And as you're seeing with the sleeve, I mean, I do like the sleeves, the detailing on the sleeves. But maybe if the neckline was different. It's kind of the same problem as the shirt you yeah, were just talking about. All just, the detailing and then nothing. Yeah. Hmm. I just, there wasn't, I don't know. And maybe maybe because spring is it coming. It probably would have been cute if they would have brought this down the front of the shirt or something. Something. Yeah. But I think because spring is right around the corner that I, I'm, and with the necklines, I don't know, maybe good I'm color, looking, though. it is a good color, especially for like St. Patty's do. Day. But so, this retails for $68. Yeah, and so I So you gotta really like it to keep a $70 shirt. Yeah. So that is going back. Now let's see this shirt. When I pulled this shirt I out, I love like, oh, this color. Ooh. I love this color. And this is by Akoa. And it retails for $59. So I like that a lot. You can wear that and, with so many different colors. Yes. And you're looking at me right now, and it is knotted, but the knot is lower, so it doesn't accentuate anything. And it is a knit top. The sleeves are wide, so you can wear it rolled up or rolled down, depending what kind of look you got. But I noticed that in this, in, when you're looking at it, it's really big in the sides. Like you can tell it's too big. It's like pulling toward the front. You can see all the gather. Yeah. And this is a 2X. So, uh, how much was this? It was $59. kind of an expensive top, but I know that I will wear this a lot because if nothing else too, I can unbutton it and I can wear it kind of like as a cardigan. No, you can't because of the, you'll have these hanging down. Yeah, but there's buttons. Uh -uh. Oh, there's no we'll buttons. These things oh, down. okay. But so what I did with this top, because I absolutely, this is like one of my favorite colors. So what I did is I just requested it in a size 1X. So I sized down in it. So I really like this. It's always fun to size down anyway. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah. So I was really, really excited. And then when I pulled out this top, I'm like, oh, I like this top too. No, and this I didn't is, like it on this you. is by Wannable. I don't like the back of it. And I pulled it out. I thought I would like it. 
And it's kind of like that very soft. Really soft. It's um, a fuzzy like, um, flannel. like flannel. And then the sleeves are just ribbed. And I thought, okay, okay. And then I put it on and I turned around. Yeah, I don't like that. And it, when you turn around, it, it's almost like... Your butt is in the biggest part of the V. Yeah, and it just really accentuated it even more. Yeah, that's a, that's a huge no-no. You know? <laughs> yeah, because the sides just kind of clung. It wasn't bad. It was, it was like, $48. It was one of the cheaper shirts in the bag, but... Yeah, but I like the shirt. I just didn't like the back at all. So that one's going back. And then... I did like this one. This one is by Cozy, Cozy Co. Company. And it's just like a spring mauve color. I well, color. I think I have more than one of those. I have more than one of these, but from different companies. And even though this was a 2X, it was like the little buttons in the were front pulling. were pulling. And so I thought, well, I can't go down in size to a 1X because then it's going to pull even more. But I have, I I went downstairs and I have one that's a little bit lighter than this. So I really didn't need this one. So we're almost done. But I do like this box better. Let me, I, even though I'm not keeping a lot of it, I do like this box better. But I'm not sure what they were thinking on these puppies. So yeah, here those is. are just brutal. And they retail for $24. I, it's just not my cup of tea now. You know I like bold jewelry, but that's brutal. That's not even good looking. Yeah, I don't. This is just so not me. That looks like a Christmas cactus. Yeah, kind of. They bloom in those kind of. fluorescent. And things. how much were they charging for $24. these? $24. Yeah, it's. Those look like um, uh, like a dollar store buy. Yeah, they do look really cheap, and it's just not my cup of tea at all. And then I have on, now, I have on the jeans right now that you're looking at, because I really liked them, and I swore I wasn't going to buy any more jeans. You know, when I walked in, and she said, oh, I, I, I bought the jeans. I'm like, they must be really good jeans, because you've got a million pair. Well, I put them on, so last night I had to go out to dinner and to see my daughter's volleyball game at this college, and her, even though... Her team is like 20s to 40-year-olds. They're just playing a college team because they're going to nationals in Florida in May. So they just need more competition to, to play and get better. So when I pulled out the jeans and I put them on and I'm like, oh, I like these jeans. I'm like, oh, but how much? You know, because I was filming my stuff in all the clothes. Well, these are by Verbit. And they're the cuffed boyfriend jeans. They're normally $68, but Cindy got them on sale for $34. Yeah, and so what I liked about them is I, I really like the cuff bottoms. And even though they're boyfriend jeans, they're not like too big, but they're comfortable. So, I mean, you're looking at me right now in them. So I wore them last night for about two hours and then three hours and I came home and I put them on today because they're so comfy. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. So all in all, I can't even tell you the last time I bought anything from Wannable. So the fact that I bought these jeans and this yellow shirt... I thought, okay, Natalia is kind of getting me. So I did really good descriptions why I'm returning the shirts I'm returning. So I'm hoping that she'll stay with me and that in two months when I get my next box, um, we'll see some nice spring transitional clothes. So I don't know. She did a much, much better job. The fact that I kept two pieces out of a Wannable, can't even tell you how long it's been since I, I did that. Hmm. So... Yes, good job. What do you guys think? When you sit up close like this, your head looks huge. Sit back See, there, it's dark. Look at your little face. Now you look like you have the big pumpkin head. Now you sit back. I have to go put some makeup on. Sit back. Now watch. Now I got the big nice. elongated watermelon face. Now you don't worry you about You have a pumpkin size. head, I have a watermelon head. <laughs> All right, ladies, we're going to go after you hit the subscribe button um, and, you know, thumbs up. Let us know you liked our video or if you didn't, tell us why so we can improve. We love constructive criticism. Yes. Yeah, we like the constructive criticism. You get those people once in a while that just want to be mean. 
I don't understand the concept, but that's a whole nother video. When I watch a video that I don't care for, I just get rid of it. I don't leave a comment yeah. or anything. I just don't watch it or I don't subscribe to it. I don't go, eh, whatever. I mean, we've been nailed on a few things by <laughs> haters, but, you know, there's always going to be those people out there. Yeah. The more and more popular you get, I, I think it's kind of funny though. When we do get a hater, we have a handful of subscribers that go after them. Yeah. Like pit bulls. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you. You know, you ladies know who you are too. <laughs> All right. Well, we've got to change our shirts and do a couple more videos. So we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.